updated. I started doing rosemary in my hair twice a week. This is only my second time doing it. So we're gonna see if I can stay consistent. But I think I will because I actually really love it. So I'm rocking it right now. I mixed it with my Jehovah oil that I usually put on my face. And actually it feels so fresh. I think you're just supposed to put it in for 20 minutes and wash it out, but I slicked my hair with it and it kind of feels good not using gel. Like I feel really clean today. I also put it on my eyebrows and my eyelashes. So we're gonna see if it makes my hair shinier, healthier and thicker. And I'm gonna keep you guys updated so you don't have to do it. So I just wanna say I am so fired up about like everything God is doing. And just reading some of the comments and the testimonies that you guys are sending me in my DM about yesterday's podcast episode, like the freedom that it gave me personally, you know, when you experience something and you're just like, oh my gosh, I just want other people so bad to hear this because like it made you so free. That's how I felt about this episode because God really spoke like to me and Austin through this. And you can just tell like when you listen, like it was not anything that was coming from our brains. Like he straight up gave us so much revelation about hidden sin how to break free what's really going on in the spiritual realm and like why the enemy wants us to sin and oh my gosh just seeing the way god has been impacting not just us but you guys through his word in that episode fires me up because breakthrough is happening the enemy's plans are getting exposed and the body of Christ is getting empowered and recognizing the authority that we have so if you haven't listened i encourage you shame does and that's satan's goal he doesn't want you to go back to grace he doesn't want you to go back to god in genesis when eve ate the apple and when they sinned like that the initial thing was god was walking through the garden he said where are you guys and he said i'm so ashamed i hid from god